In this problem, we're being asked to look at some claims that are being made based on something we know about an average. The problem says a job placement agency advertised that last year, its clients, on average, had a starting salary of $38,500. And then it says that average is the same thing as mean. Which of the following claims are true? And there's this whole list of, of claims here. So let's think about what we actually know first. This is the sentence that gives us what we know. And first of all, it's about last year. So if somebody makes a claim about any other year than last year, we can just say we don't know because we only know something about last year. And what we know is that those starting salaries, the average was 38500 So let's think for a minute about how you get an average of 38500 Well, one way could be that everybody got paid $38,500. If everybody had the same salary, the average would be $38,500. Uh, other, the other way would be that there are some people who earned above $38,000, some people who earned below, and they balance out or average out to $38,500. So those are really the only two cases we could have. Now let's look at what these statements say. The first one says, Two years ago, some of their clients had a starting salary of at least $38,500. Well, that might be true, but we don't know. This says two years ago. That has nothing to do with the fact uh, uh, that was given to us above. So this one, we can't say is true. The next one says, last year, at least one of their clients had a starting salary of $38,500 or above. This one, I think, has to be true because the two ways you can have an average of $38,500 is for everybody to have $38,500 or for some to be above and some to be below. So either way, you've got to have uh, someone with a starting salary of $38,500 or above. So true. All right, our next one says, last year, at least one of their clients had a starting salary of exactly $38,500. Well, maybe that might be the case, but it doesn't have to be. You could have um, two new clients, and one had below $38,500, one had above, but they average out to $38,500. So this one, we can't say is true. The next one says, last year, some of their clients had a starting salary of less than $41,000. So, remember, the two ways to get an average of 38500 is everybody has 38500 That means they would be below 41000 Or some are above 38500 and some are below 38500 which means somebody would be below, er, below 41000 So this one has to be true. And this next one says, last year, more than half of their clients had a starting salary of at least 38500 we can't say that for sure. It could be that the majority of people who were hired were hired for just under 38500 and maybe one or two people had salaries that were way above it and would kind of skew the sample, and it would still average out to 38500 even though most of the people would be below. So this one, not true. And finally, it says none of the above statements is true. We found two of them who were true, so this one cannot be true. So that is a little bit of work with claims based on averages.